And I got to ask a question. Who's excited for American Idol that it's back? And if you have been watching, one of the best moments so far is that, lo that so-called love triangle involving <laughs> Katy Perry, a handsome contestant named Trevor, and um, Trevor's girlfriend named Sierra. Well, now Trevor and Sierra are joining us live from L.A. Hello, you two. Good morning. Good morning. Well, that is a handsome couple. Yeah. Very, We're very fans of the show. <laughs> well, th thank you. And you're right, George. That is a handsome couple. And Trevor, I have a question for oh, you. Stop. You, you yes. got the ticket to Hollywood. How have the I past? Did. How have I, the past 48 hours been for you? Man, it's been so surreal. It's one of those things you always kind of dream about, and then it actually happens, and you go, I, I have to pinch myself every morning when I wake up because it still doesn't feel real. Well, you got Sierra. She can pinch you, too, if you need help. <laughs> <laughs> I think she does. It's been pretty crazy. <laughs> Walk us through that audition, Trevor. You're in that room. You, you admit you had a little crush on Katy Perry for a long time. Yeah. So then she starts flirting with you. What's going through your mind? <laughs> well, it's funny. You know, like, everybody growing up, you always have this, like, celebrity crush that you never think you'll actually meet. And under my circumstance, I had to go in and sing in, in front of her. And... And, uh, you know, to have her, like, I'm out there, trying, I'm singing my heart out, and she's flirting with me, and I'm like, you can't really put it into words. It's pretty surreal. <laughs> Just it's important, Sierra. Why don't you try to put this into words? What were you thinking? <laughs> fully supportive of it. We all have celebrity crushes, but it was really funny because when they asked me to run in, I was just beelining towards him because I was so excited for him, and I had no idea that I even cut Katie off. <laughs> but it was, we, and we, had, we had so much fun, and Katie and I hugged, and we laughed about it, and I even told her that we could share him. See, you say that, you say that no idea with such an innocent smile right there. <laughs> I really didn't have any idea. I mean, like, we're out Outside and we can't hear anything that's going on. We could sort of hear that he's singing and he sang a second song about me, which they didn't air. And I knew then that like, and the producers were like, yeah, the girlfriend's out here. And I was like, oh God. <laughs> and they asked me to go in and it was just a blur, you well, know. Trevor, I don't even think that he knew what was happening. Well, when Sierra walks in, what goes through your mind? Because you had a little moment there with Katy Perry. <laughs> yeah, well, so, so I mean, <laughs> so I got my gold, I got my golden ticket, and I, like the first thing I said, they go, "You're going to Hollywood," and I actually go, "Like, are you serious?" I, I am. They go, "Yeah," and so I go, "Oh, oh my God!" And so I, I walk forward to get my ticket. I see Katie, Katie coming around to give me a hug, and then my mom and my girlfriend are running in from the other side. I thought they were gonna tackle me and knock me over, <laughs> and then just you're just so filled with adrenaline. It's just yeah, it's crazy. Uh, I, I could tell you what was going through your mind, Trevor, but I can't use those words on TV. <laughs> 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 I tell you what. Good luck. Good luck. Good thank luck. You. We'll thank be watching so uh, Trevor Sierra. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. And do not forget to tune in for more of American Idol's return Sunday at 8 p.m. right here on ABC, you guys. And now we have a great guest to bring to the table, Oscar-winning actress starring in the new Tomb Raider. Please welcome Alicia Vikander. <laughs> is the double. Welcome back. Thank you. So, you, as we mentioned, you won an Oscar for the Danish Girl, but I just read, and I can't believe this, you actually don't have your own Oscar? Oh my God, yes. It's been, it's been two years now of me saying <laughs> no. it. I, it feels like people believe I'm but no, I've been, uh, I, I, I've been traveling in my suitcases for two years just working and I've been renovating my house. I'm soon going to take it home. But it's my friend's daughter who has it in her room. she's keeping good care of it. Yeah, she sent me, I actually met her mom in LA now and I was like, she, she better send me another photo now to make sure that he's fine and <laughs> see what he's up to. Well, speaking of house, you just got married. Congratulations. Thank Last you. Time. So will yes. Oscar go to Lisbon? Lisbon. Yeah. What, what, what's, where, what's home in Lisbon like and why oh, there? It's the most beautiful city and country. Uh, um, great weather for someone who's Irish and Swedish. <laughs> We're very happy that it's not raining. Um, and um, yeah, no, it's, uh, it's a great place where you can, you can surf and be close to nature. It's a city by the water. So mm. it's and, and it's a little different than where you're, where you're from, but also this movie, The Departure, from what we're used to seeing you in, Lara Croft, 
Tomb Raider. Love this movie. How is it for you? Do you always want to be an action star? I mean, to be honest, I mean, I grew up in Sweden and I had a, my, my mom was an actress and probably introduced me to a lot of European art house cinema and all that. But I mean, I've always been a kid and I still do. I run to the cinema to see big adventure films and action movies. And uh, I was, I, I mean, I was a huge fan of the Indiana Jones movies and the Mummy series. But did you ever up. think it'd be you? Of course not. <laughs> no. Uh, I mean, like I said, I mean, I, I was brought up in a small country, so I probably I didn't think it was possible to work in English language uh, growing up. So it was kind of like another universe, all the Hollywood films. Well, let's see you in action. I think we've got a clip here. out to get in that role yeah you know now I've been on the road for four weeks doing press and I've been looking at these clips and like you know images like oh my god I need to get back to the gym because <laughs> it's all gone Did now. Did you get addicted to it? I mean, it is. I mean, it's very empowering because I, 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 I kind of looked at a lot of um, female athletes and stunt women that I met over the years in the film industry, and I was like, well, for it's, if it's going to be plausible that Laura can do this, because we did a quite maybe a bit more of a raw and naturalistic take, then I want to look like these women yeah. that I've so much <laughs> looked up to. So. Yeah. Well, you want to be looked up to. You're you're the embodiment of a cultural icon because now. You have your own Barbie doll. <laughs> <laughs> is, is that is that a little surreal? To it you? is very surreal. I mean, it's it's but it's pretty yeah, cool. I, I didn't yeah. know, but Barbie apparently and like have embodied quite a few like cool female, uh, you know, action or uh, fictional characters over the years. So I feel you know it's a great honor. This, I, this is probably, but probably even further away of what I thought would be possible when I was a kid. Well, you but can trade it with Barbie would have been like the. You can put her next to Oscar when you get Oscar. Well, yeah, trade it for yeah. the girls. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> but Terry, we appreciate you being here, and we can't wait to see this movie. I think you're perfect Thank for you it. So yeah. Much for Congratulations. Me. Thank you. It is Tomb Raider. It hits theaters on Friday. Make sure you go check it out, everybody. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.